Can I tell you this? For some of you, you need to suspend ministry activities for a while and go back to the altar. This, this deception of invitations and open door can dry you spiritually. Oh, I'm doing ministry, exploits. I'm traveling from nation to nation. Isaiah was doing ministry when there was a call in heaven, who shall go for us? Whereas on earth there was ministry going on. All kinds of things. When people clap and say, Joshua Selman, you are busy, you go from place to place. I just smile and respectfully say, God bless you. When I return back with God, I say I reject deception. Oh God, I, your boy is here from where you found me. May I ever remain there. Ministry nonsense. Right from the place of his presence, he can honor you to bless the nations. But see, Satan will give you ministry open doors a thousand times if it will cost you his presence. Oh, with Jesus' joy, he will open doors for you. Not every open door is anointed. I've told you this thing. There are doors you have to shut intentionally. Please return, return. I don't know who I'm speaking to, but the Holy Spirit is speaking to someone. Return, return. I'm not condemning you, but return. God is saying, I am still waiting. Return to the place of the altar, the place of fire, the place of power. Return to the place of his presence. He called them that they would be with him and then represent him. I'd rather be called a failure as a man of God and yet succeed and win with God than to have the accolades of men across the nations and then you do not carry any weight with God. Someone pray right where you are. Father, grace to return. Please, someone pray. Pray. Grace to return. Grace to return. Shalamakatapakatos Grace to return, oh God. Mm. Pray one minute. More love, more power, more of you in my life. More love. More power, more of you in my life. Please pray one minute. More love, more power, more of you in my life. 